Starlink Residential Service uses Carrier Grade Network Address Translation, or CGNAT. This means you don't get a unique public IP address. Instead, your device shares an IP with other users, limiting direct port forwarding. While this saves IPv4 addresses and adds a layer of security, it complicates things like hosting game servers or accessing devices remotely. Your IP address is dynamic and can change every few hours or days due to network optimizations. Check your IP address in the Starlink app under the Network tab. Note that CGNAT obscures your true public IP. Officially, Starlink doesn't provide a way to manually change your IP address. This is due to carrier-grade NAT, which shares public IPs among users, making individual changes difficult. However, power cycling your Starlink dish for 30 seconds or more can sometimes force a reconnection and assign a new IP, though success isn't guaranteed. Physically moving the dish might also trigger a change due to satellite handoffs. Starlink offers limited port forwarding through its app, but it requires bypass mode with a third-party router. For a dedicated public IP, consider upgrading to Starlink's public IP add-on, which costs extra per month if available in your region. Starlink is working towards IPv6 support, which could eventually alleviate CGNAT and simplify IP management.